Hey, if you're like most people, you probably haven't thought much about the life of the chicken you're about to eat for dinner. Yeah, but a St. Clair County family wants to change that because they say how and where that chicken was raised makes a difference to its health and the health of the people who consume it. WVTM 13's Lisa Crane takes us to a farm near Argo where the farmer wants you to see and understand the process. Hunter Morgan and his wife Madison were happy to leave the hustle and bustle of Nashville and move back home to the Morgan family farm. They knew they wanted to farm, but they weren't exactly sure what that would look like. <laughs> we never envisioned it would be chickens. Our family was thought we were a little nuts in the beginning. Scratch made farm was born and chickens it would be. Hunter says at first it was just a way for the family to eat healthier. We really wanted uh, pasture raised meat for our family and so this is something we wanted to do for our family. We have the space to do it and so our thought process is if we're going to do this for our family, let's make it available for other families as well. They have chickens they raise for meat and different breeds of hens for eggs. The egg business is slow now after a traumatic setback. A few weeks ago I had an attack on our coop in the middle of the night. Some wild animal came in, dug underneath our movable coops. Uh, and killed 25 chickens overnight. So we had a pretty big setback. But these chicks will soon be old enough to lay eggs and will help boost that side of the business. Hunter says raising chickens on a pasture in coops they move every single day is more work and it's more expensive. So you're gonna pay more for his chicken than you would at a grocery store. But he says it makes for healthier animals. He says the meat has more omega-3 fatty acid and less saturated fat than conventionally raised chickens. And that's important to his customers. In St. Clair County, Lisa Crane, WVTM 13.